Come on, Sophia. Look at this. Oh. I think mom needs to work on her hiding places. This is just what I need. I'm never gonna get my snacks into class. There must be a way to sneak them in. Wait a minute. I've got it. I'll place some double-sided tape inside my hat. Then remove the backing. Hey, you're late. Yeah, but it was worth it. Look at all these tasty snacks. Mmm, I don't need a magic spell to enjoy these. I'll put the chocolate bar on my phone case. Now watch this. Chocolatous cases! It worked! That's the best phone case ever! Can I have a piece? I have a secret to tell you about this eraser. Remove the cardboard from an eraser. Use a scalpel to cut the eraser into three sections. Remove the largest section. Next, we need some glue. Apply the glue to one of the smaller pieces. Then stick it to the cardboard, making sure it's secure. Then get your favorite candy and fill the cardboard with it. Mmm, I'm getting hungry already. Finally, put the other piece on top. A secret candy supply. The teacher will never know. Pretty smart, huh? This candy looks delicious. Oh, confiscating candy is hard work. I know how I can keep this candy for myself. I'm a genius! I'll start by taking off my tie. I'll put some double-sided tape on the candy bar. Then I'll stick it to the underside of my tie. Perfect! I have good taste in fashion. Ha! I need to hide this candy. But where? Hmm. That gives me an idea. I need to grow a beard. Or make a fake one. First, I need a fake beard and a glue gun. I'll apply the glue in a U-shape. Once that's done, I'll stick a piece of card onto it, making a pocket. I'll fill the pocket with candy. But not too much. Now I can hide my candy! I just love soda, but I can't let mom find out. Oh no! I need to hide this! Huh? I think I know where to put it. I need to be quick. I'll just pour the soda into the hot water bottle. That should be enough. Now I'll put a plastic tube into it. I mean, I can't drink out the water bottle. I'll feed the tube up my sleeve. And out the top of my pajamas. Time for bed! But first, I'll have a little drink. Mmm. It's mom! I better put this away! I hope I get in. Ow! My broken arm! It's so sore! That must have hurt. You can go in. Thanks! I can't believe he fell for that. To sneak candy, you just need some rolls of tape. Join them together with a length of double-sided tape. Remove the backing from the tape. And stick a drink pouch to it. Then wrap a bandage around them. Make sure you can't see the drink through the bandage. You might need a number of layers. It's that easy! Whoa! You can go right in. Yes! Check this out. Lay a t-shirt flat on a table. Then place tape on a chips packet. Stick the chips to the t-shirt and a selection of other candy. Put the t-shirt on and you'll have all the snacks you need. And you look pretty swole. Great party, but you're missing the disco ball. It looks pretty tasty, huh? Take a watermelon and spray it with silver paint. Make sure to cover it all and leave it to dry. Next, cut some squares out of aluminum foil. Stick the squares to the watermelon, arranging them into a pattern. Until you have a disco ball. Whoa! That's amazing! There's enough for everyone! Woohoo! Let's party! I'm hungry. Luckily, my nails are delicious. For edible nails, all you need is a piece of candy. 
Mold the candy around fake nails. Press and flatten it until it covers the nail. Then all you need to do is wear them. This color really suits me. It's an easy way to sneak candy. I'm ready to party! They look good and taste great! Welcome to another tasty episode of Cooking with Sarah. Whoa! That sounds amazing! Let's get started! Carefully cut the ice cream carton into three pieces. Just like this. We'll use the middle section. Place the ice cream onto the cookie. Remove the carton and put another cookie on top. Now that looks good enough to eat! I'm so hungry. Time for a snack. Huh? Why isn't this knife cutting the bun? The bun is rock hard! Ugh, this is a problem. I hope those hours in the gym pay off! There's an easier way. Pour water over the bun. Then place it into the oven. The steam will soften the roll. That's better. Whoa! That's so smart! Let's add lemon juice to our salad. I'll just cut it in half. We don't need too much juice. Not so fast! What is it? Don't squeeze it. The pips will get everywhere. Try this way. All you need is a toothpick. Start by rolling the lemon to make it juicier. Then start to make a hole with the toothpick. Then just squeeze the lemon over the salad. Whoa! Mmm, a nice juicy orange. Huh, this is tricky. I just can't seem to peel it. Maybe I could use the spoon. That's a great idea! I'll push the spoon into the orange rind. Then run it along the orange. It removed the rind from the flesh. Now I can just lift it off. Mmm! It's not fair! I want a soda! Mmm, that spray bottle gives me an idea. Take a clean spray bottle and remove the top. Place a funnel into the bottle. Now grab your favorite soda. Pour the soda into the bottle. It's a lot easier with the funnel. Then just screw the top back on. Now I can have my soda. Hey, mom. Is that new aftershave? How are we gonna cut the cake? I think I have an idea. I need this string. I know what I'm doing. If you don't have a knife to cut a cake, just improvise. Hold the string tight and use it to slice the cake. Just move it gently back and forth. It works just as good as a knife. That was hungry work! Let's eat! That is a good cake! When hunger strikes, it helps to be prepared. With these useful hacks, you'll never be without your favorite snacks. What's your favorite way to sneak food? Let us know in the comments below! Remember to share this video with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more fun videos just like this!